It's Premier Su Jintang's second day in office, and he spent it taking a turn about the legislative yuan. And during his whirlwind tour, Premier Su paid courtesy calls to lawmakers across the political spectrum, shaking hands and cracking jokes along the way. On the second day of his second term as Premier, Su led his deputy and Secretary General on a trip to the legislature. His first stop was the office of Su Jiaquan, head of the legislative yuan. In the future, Lawmakers will say, you need a suit, and both of us will turn our heads. So we might need to work a bit on differentiation, on what exactly each of us will be called. We could go by Executive Yuan Leader Su and Legislative Yuan Leader Su. Or how about Big S and Little S? What do you say? In the future, if you have a difficult and complicated problem, please take it directly to the Yuan Leader Su who is sitting in the speaker's chair. The easier problems you can bring straight to me. After visiting the legislative speaker, the premier paid an equally courteous call to former legislative speaker Wang Jingping. And then it was off to the offices of the New Power Party and People First Party. The way the premier spent his first day conducting inspections at the airport, we are really impressed by the boldness he showed. Chairman Song had said before, Su Zhenchang is probably the only person who could step up as premier right now and temporarily stabilize the situation. Even the opposition camp had some favorable words for the old war horse. I had served in the government under this premier. I have seen for myself his ability to execute policies. Premier Su was busy all day paying calls to lawmakers. At the end of his itinerary, he headed across the street back to the executive yuan for more official duties.